Okay, you guys, we're looking at a newer furnace that we installed. Uh, this is going to stay here. Uh, this here is the uh, evaporator coil that has some leaks and restrictions, so we're going to be replacing that. Um, the return air drop, we're going to modify this basically from this S and drive just above the, uh, the literature here. Got dimensions of that, and then a new spacer in between uh, with, the, um, with an air cleaner. Uh, just to get a lot better airflow for this system and then uh, everything else is staying the same flue piping all that's okay this unit is actually already r410a so refrigerant lines will stay we'll just cut out um, well there's no suction line dryer but we'll cut out the uh, existing meter device we'll have a coil that will already have that so obviously cut that out and then just uh, line set runs over here but we'll leave that all alone and make our connection outside condensate drain Right now it's currently running all the way over and catching the uh, the drain over here. Uh, we'll see if we're going to leave that the same or if they want to put that on a pump. I think everything's been working fine so uh, we may just leave that. I'll get a patch made for the supply trunk here um, and the fittings will be prefabricated and brought out uh, with the apprentice for the return air drop.